Hello champions, we got one last character to preview and this time it is Tucker Heavy Machinery. He is the free character that we're getting this month and that we're going to be working on pretty much the whole month. Let's have a look. He's a showboat as well. His coach ability at 5000 is red submission move last two less turns. So it's kind of like uh, the others when you use a, a submission but you just want it to end earlier so that the gem remains that's going to be is used so pretty limited links with heavy machinery which is yellow gem do 100 percent more damage and modern era and he doesn't have any gear we're gonna have a look at five star bronze now i will do my own uh, three star bronze preview probably tomorrow when i get my own so for now it's five star bronze because that's the one they lend me to do this preview and when they take it back i'll be leveling my own at three star bronze so the first move set and you're going to see that they all look a lot alike basically all move sets are going to be based on the three yellow moves and the two greens the two blues are really not that useful uh we'll look at them at the end but yeah pretty much everything i can come up with is based on some of the yellows and some of the green it's a lot of mix and match uh, same with trainers although a lot of the trainers are going to be remaining the same as well but you'll see first we're going to have a look at is the yellow two and yellow three along with green one it is the power slam nine mp yellow move deal 34.6k damage and choose seven gems to destroy the falling iptus 8 MP green move, deal 29.3k damage, and choose 7 by one area to make into Protect Gem of Strength 10.7k. And the Arm Trap Suplex, 9 MP yellow move, deal 42.2k damage, and increase the strength of your Protect Gem by 7,025. Now the trainers we'll use for that is Akam to start with 4 more yellows. Then we're going to use Zombie Maka Nakamura to destroy 4 extra move with the Power Slam. And also yellow move will do 30% extra damage as well. Very useful trainer for this. Uh, I put in NWO Ogun as a coach in there. Obviously when I do my 3 star version I will use only... Uh, very common ca uh, very common coaches and trainers so i won't be using ogan but for this we're going for the best options so we're going to put ogan and i do have also earthquake in there he does treat one extra protect gem which in this case won't do anything but he uh, makes the protect gem protect from an, adi an additional 20 percent which is useful for the following ip iptus so we're going to do this Oop, I forgot to pick a target, sorry. All right, so we're gonna do it versus Ted. Now, as usual, he's got his 43% uh, defense on all gem and 18 from moves. And on my end, I got 15% more L gem, do 15% more damage. All color moves start with two more MP. Take 10% less damage from all color move, and we do have the 25% extra gem damage due to the class advantage. That gives us a total of 30% at 40% extra gem damage, and he soaks up 43%. So evens out he has a 3% advantage in the end. Right, so we do have a yellow match here. Let's get our green. I'm not gonna destroy more because I don't want my turn to end. go now we're gonna make a batch of protect gems we're gonna boost them now they are 
21.2k each. Take some green here. Half are gone. <laughs> Don't have any yellow or any green. That gave us some greens. Can't move this one here. Uh, get these red, I guess. Pretty limited in what I can move. This is not going well at all. I'm not getting any yellows. I can't generate any yellows. I'm not liking this move set at all so far. We don't have any left by now, but it's been like 15 turns. Put it here. Let's boost it. Well, there's barely any yellows on the board. There's only one. Take this. Anything I can make collapse. This will give me some yellow damage. Pretty much it. Let's take away the remaining like that. couldn't kick out thanks to the gem. Alright, it works, but I don't like it. There's gotta be a better way. Alright, second move set for Tucker. It's gonna be green one, green two, and still the uh, yellow three. It is a leaping elbow drop, eight MP green move, deal 25.7k damage and make six random gems into yellows. Falling Iptas, 8 MP green move, deal 29.3k damage and choose 7x1 area to make into protect gem of strength 10.7k. The arm tram suplex, 9 MP yellow move, deal 42.2k damage and increase the strength of your protect gem by 7000. Trainers we're going to use for that is steel to start with more green MP. Ziggler to uh, have more yellows on the leaping elbow drop. Ogan to help getting both colors and Earthquake to boost 20% of the strength of the Protect Gems.
All right, so we're gonna try versus Vader instead of Ted. There's not, there won't be any class advantage or anything. The reason I'm doing that is because Ted keeps going for the yellow and I can't find any other striker on the road. I checked like for five minutes, couldn't find one. So we'll go over versus Vader. He doesn't have any belts on, so I'm gonna have a 15% advantage and that's it. Tucker's so tall, he's almost out of the screen. Uh, let's get yellow. Right. Did we use it right away? Eh, yeah, what the hell? Let's use it. We'll get some yellow out. If we can have just one match, that'd be perfect. Perfect. We can increase their values. Unfortunately, I'm going to need to kill one to get this. Wow. He got all of them on the row. <laughs> all right. Uh, we got to get some greens. So unfortunately, it's getting rid of some of them. We don't have much left. Let's get green again. Okay. Let's get more out on the bottom. Let's make yellows and hope for a match. multiple matches so that's gonna end our turn only have four left he keeps getting rid of him Okay, let's boost the fours we have left. Get green here. Three left. else than the oh, that's all there is I pick someone else <laughs> instead of going for yellow they're going for green so <laughs> we're getting similar res result we did with dead two left This time, let's get the yellows out first. Nothing matched. Could get an extra turn or not. Choice is the purple here. Oh, that was enough to get out of it. Okay, let's put that. No, 
now we gotta try to make a pin. a lot of them but that's not like I had a lot of options not a fan of this move set so far he just got rid of most of them One left. And he's dead. That worked, but it took forever. And uh, there's gotta be something better again. All right, next move set. This time it's gonna be the yellow one, yellow two, and green two. It is the atomic drop, 12 MP yellow move, finisher deal 78.4k damage, and destroy nine random yellow gems and pin the opponent. The power slam, nine MP yellow move, deal 34.6k damage, and choose seven gems to destroy. And the leaping elbow drop, eight MP green move, deal 25.7k damage, and make six random gems into yellow gems. Now trainers, we use a cam to start with more yellow. Could be using also steel. Uh, using Zaka, uh, Zakamura. Zombie Nakamura to destroy four extra gems with both yellow move. And yellow move do 30% more damage. That's pretty good. That makes the finisher do 102. We use Ogen to create one more yellow and Arlen Booker to create one more yellow again and yellow plus 5%. So that way we don't use Ziggler. Could be using Ziggler also as a trainer, uh, but I kind of like Nakamura better because he boosts both move damage and adds four to each. Like it's unlikely that we'll ever need 13 uh, for the finisher because there's probably never going to be 13 yellows on the board, but the choosing 11 on the power slam is pretty useful because you pick what you destroy. So you can pick greens, you can pick yellow, or you can pick just gems to make a cascade. So, all right, let's do this versus Vader again. Alright, so let's get hello here. We need one yellow. We need a few greens. And the rest is all gonna be damaged, so this is gonna collapse. Those will break. Other than that, I don't well, this is gonna break also, but don't have a lot of options, so we'll just go for damage. No, let's not take the yellows. We want the yellows to remain on the board. Alright, let's do the finisher. Enough to load our second move. Now let's make yellows on the board. We need five on the finisher. That'll give us the five we need. Can I make anything else collapse? Not really. 
And I don't really want a cascade that's going to finish everything. So we'll stop at this. That way it's going to remain our turn. Almost didn't. <laughs> All right. Give me more yellows. He kicked out. I definitely like this one better so far that seems like it's really the most uh the the one that you're that you're gonna be less reliant on getting a good board like it's board i wouldn't say board proof but uh it's definitely better all right let's have a look at the last one all right last move set for tucker it's gonna be the green one, green two, yellow two. The falling Iptos, eight MP green move, deal 29.3k damage and choose a seven by one area to make into protect gems of strength 10.7k. Power slam, nine MP yellow move, deal 34.6k damage and choose seven gems to destroy. And the leaping elbow drop, eight MP green move, deal 25.7k damage and make six random gems into yellow gems. Trainers for that we're gonna use. Oh, sorry, we don't. We won't use a cam. We will use steel. Right. So we're gonna use steel to start with more green. We're gonna use Callisto so that the protect gems are gonna do 16k instead of 10,000. We could have used still Zombie Nakamura, but I found on the previous one that we really didn't need that many to destroy. So I think set 7 is going to be enough. So we'll use Kalisto instead to have uh, more strong power gems. And uh, we keep Ogun and Booker so that the Leaping Elbow is making 8 instead of 6. Alright, let's try this against Vader again. And a green match to finish this. Okay. Let's make those all the way down. Let's make random yellows. And that thing matched. Let's take those. Okay. I'm not going to use the four. I'm, like I could have got the whole row, but I went with three because I want to have a good amount of yellows that remain. Now we're going to choose what to destroy. Now, unfortunately... We don't have much options. Uh, most of our green are down there, but I don't want to burn them. So we'll drop that. Right, whatever. Okay. Oh, we'll take this one.
Okay, uh, we're missing one green. And the rest is yellows. Okay, let's make another rope. Let's make some yellows. Okay, let's get some greens and a couple bonus yellows. I'll take this one just because I really need the green. That was one green short of being good for next turn. Ah, oh, well, we were still good thanks to the Protect Gems. I did still work, Stanley. I kind of like the previous one better, though. And I'm going to show you the uh, two blue moves that we haven't used. The two blue moves we haven't used are the uh, Lutez Press, which is a 7 MP blue move. Deal 22.5k damage and make six random blacks into yellow gems. Reason I don't use that is that we got a green move that already makes random yellow gems, but it can do it with any color, which is much more open than specifically black. And also the standing drop kick 5 MP blue move deal 13.7k damage and convert all power gems into protect gems of 16.7 thousand. This move would actually be very good versus characters like Booker T, Sid, uh, what's his name? Show, uh, not Showboat, uh, uh, what's his name? Steamboat. So basically those that create a lot of uh, power gems, this would be really good to use for that. And then maybe you would want to use both blues together, but probably not and still take the standing dropkick. So that's pretty much it for Tucker. Uh, I think he's a pretty decent free guy. At least we'll, he's got moveset that we can definitely use uh throughout the whole month so that's it guys thanks for watching if you're not already a sub make sure to do so to be kept aware when i post new stuff have any questions ask them and if you like the video leave a like and share see you guys Gio. ciao